Okay, nandito na naman tayo sa next lesson. Adding polynomials. So, gagamitin na natin yung mga pinag-aralan natin sa mga integers. Okay, so, find the sum of polynomials by using the vertical or the horizontal method. So, number one, add 3z plus 7 and 9z plus 2. So, yung horizontal method, nakalinya siya. Horizontal nga. So, natin horizontal. Yung vertical, magkatapat sila. So, punta muna tayo sa horizontal method. So, ang gagawin natin is i-combine natin yung similar terms. Ibig sabihin ng similar terms, yung magkaparehas. Ito, 3z, ito, 9z. Pwede i-combine. Bawal yung 3z, saka 2, kasi walang z ito. So, saka 7, saka 2. So, gagamitin natin yung mga sign nila. Ito, positive, saka positive. So, mag-a-add. In addition of integers, mag-a-add sila. 3 plus 9, magiging 12z. Okay, then, pwede natin combine yung constant, yung number, 7 and 2. So, 7 and 2 is 9. So, positive, 9. Kasi pareha sila na positive. Ulitin ko. In adding polynomials, gagamitin mo pa rin yung rule sa adding integers. Pero, yung similar terms. Ito, 3z to 9z, pwede mong pagsamahin. Okay? Kasi may z sila parehas. Similar terms, magkaparehas. So, 3 plus 9 is 12. Itong 7 at 2, pwede mo combine kasi pareha silang number. Constant ang tawag doon. So, 7 plus 2 is 9. Positive plus positive is positive. So, plus 9. Yan yung horizontal method. Pwede direct na. Okay. Ito naman yung vertical. Yung magkakatapat-tapat sila para mas madali. Yung una, yung 3z plus 7. Tatapat mo naman yung 9z plus 2. Tinapat mo dun sa similar terms. Okay. So, magkatapat sila. Pwede mong i-combine. Combine similar terms. Okay? So, pag parehas yung signs, positive 3, positive 9, mag-a-add sa addition. So, positive 12. So, yung positive, kahit hindi mo nalagyan ng positive yan, understood, positive na siya. So, 12 Z. Yung Z kakapi mo lang. Yung, yung variable niya. Tawag dito variable, yung number constant. Then, positive plus positive is positive. And, you add 7 plus 2 is 9. So, parehas lang yung answer. Horizontal method, vertical method, pwede mong alin yung gamitin mo dyan, kung saan ka nadadalihan. Intindihan ba natin? So, yung vertical method, ulitin ko, pinapat natin yung magkaparehas similar terms. Ito namang constant, magkatapat, nandun sa given. Tapos, sinundan lang natin yung addition of integers. Pag hindi nyo pa alam yung addition of integers, reviewin nyo yung, yung lesson na pinos ko. Yung topic and doon. Okay, addition. 3 plus 9 is 12z. 7 plus 2 is 9. Okay, naitindihan ba natin? Okay, punta tayo sa number 2. Add 3x squared plus 2 and 7x squared minus 6x plus 3. So, horizontal method, isang linya na naman sila. Okay, kinapi ko lang yung given doon. Then, ikukombine natin yung similar terms. Okay, yung magkaparehas. So, para hindi ka maguluhan, unahin mo yung mas mataas yung exponent. Ito, x squared, pwede mo na-combine dito. So, guguhitan ko yan para hindi ako malito. Okay, yung dalawang yun, kukombine ko. Ayan. Positive and positive, so mag add sila. So, 10x squared. Positive sila. Dito, walang x. Dito, mayroong x. So, wala siyang partner. Kung wala siyang partner, kakapi mo lang. So, minus 6x. Kasi yung sign niya doon, minus. Tapos, yung number, pwede mong pagsamahin. Iba naman yung buhit ko para hindi ako malito. Positive 2, positive 3, so, parehas silang positive, mag-add. So, positive pa rin. And 2 plus 3 is 5. Ulitin ko. So, yung first, yung x squared, saka 7x squared. Yung 3x squared, saka 7x squared, similar terms. Okay, positive 
positive, parehas ang signs. Okay, so mag add sila. 3 plus 7 is 10. X squared, copy mo lang kasi X squared sila. Dito may X, dito wala. So, kakapi mo lang siya, minus 6X. Ito yung number, ito yung number, pwede mo pagsamahin. Similar terms. Okay, so 2 plus 3 is 5. Okay, nakuha ba natin? Yan yung horizontal method. Next is the vertical method. Kailangan magkakatapat naman sila. So, yung una, 3x squared plus 2. 7x squared minus 6x plus 3. Sir, may space dito. Kasi wala siyang x. So, sa kabila walang x, kaya blanco na lang dyan. Okay, wala siyang kaparehas. Then, i-add na natin addition of integers. 3 plus 7 is positive 10. Okay, 10. Copy yung x squared. Ito, wala siyang i-combine. So, bring down mo lang yan. Ito, 2 plus 3 is positive. Mag-add lang sila. So, positive 5. So, gano lang siya. Kadali. So, parehas yung answer natin. 10x squared minus 6x plus 5. Ito naman, 10x squared minus 6x plus 5. So, horizontal sa vertical method, parehas lang. So, ganyan lang siya. Kadali. Naintindihan ba natin? Okay, meron pa tayong dalawang example para maintindihan nyo mabuti. Add 3s squared plus 5st minus 7t squared and 6s squared minus 7st plus 6t squared. So, ito na naman yon horizontal method. Ito yung vertical method. So, anong gagawin natin? Kailangan ikukombine natin yung magkaparehas. So, magkaparehas dyan is yung kubuhitan ko para hindi ako malito. 3s squared saka 6s squared. Pwede natin ikombine. Combine similar terms. So, 3 plus 6, parehas sila ng positive. So, magiging 9s squared. Okay. Then, ano pa yung parehas? Ito, isang guhit lang kasi magkaparehas yan. Kaya lang, unlike sign, ito positive 5, ito negative 7. So, magsusubtract sila. Masusunod yung sign ng mas malaki. So, negative 2SP. Ito naman, magkaparehas sila. Saka ito, 7 T squared. So, yung given may T squared doon. Hindi na po may T squared doon. So, magkaparehas sila. Okay. May t squared. So, ito similar sila. Similar dito sa kato. Kasi yun ang given. So, negative sa positive. Unlike sign, magsusubtract ulit. Kaya lang yung sign mas malaki is negative. So, minus ito. Minus t squared. Okay. So, ulitin ko. Ang ginawa ko, ginuhitan ko yung dalawa, yung magkaparehas para hindi ako malito. Tapos, 3s squared saka 6x squared mag a sila. So, magiging 9s squared. Ang positive 5st saka negative 7 is st in similar terms. Kaya lang, unlike sign, so, magma-minus sila. Okay? And yung negative 7t squared plus 6t squared, unlike sign, so, magma-minus din sila. Kaya nagiging 7 minus 6, magiging negative 1t squared. Kaya lang, pag 1, huwag mo na isusulat. Understood na? One na yung pagwalang value. Okay? Nakuha ba natin? Okay. Punta naman tayo sa vertical method. So, kailangan naka-align. Okay? Naka-align sila. So, 3s squared plus 5st minus 7t squared. Katapat niya ang 6s squared minus 7st plus 6t squared. So, nakatapat sila. Then, isusol na natin. So, 3 plus 6 is magiging 9 9s t squared positive 5 saka negative 7 ang like sign so magiging negative 2s t and yung last one yung negative 7 t squared plus 6 t squared is ang like sign so magsusubtract sila mas ang sign ng mas malaki is negative. So, magiging negative negative t squared. Okay. Kuha ba natin? 
So, yun yung kwal niya. 3s squared plus 6s squared is 9s squared. Tapos, yung positive 5st minus 7st is unlike sign. So, negative 2st. Then, negative 7t squared plus 6t squared is unlike sign. Mas malaki yung negative 7. Kaya, negative t squared. So, pag titignan nyo, yung answer natin, 9s squared minus 2st minus t squared is magka parehas. Okay? So, parehas na parehas yung answer natin. So, ito yung mga lesson natin na pwede natin gamitin yung adding of integers. So, ang susunod na lesson na natin is yung subtracting uh, polynomials. Gagamitin natin yon And multiplication of polynomials and division of polynomials. So, tumutok lang kayo dito sa Matuto Learn to Love Math. Till next time!